And breaking news, months after a Greene County postal carrier was hit and killed while delivering mail, charges have been filed. KDK's Jennifer Barrasso is live in Greene County right now, and she just talked to the Greene County Regional Police Chief. Jen, what did he have to say? Well, Kim, a lot of charges against Tina Phillips, who is accused of hitting and killing a beloved mail carrier, Chad Varner, last year. And the police chief saying this all had to do what was not in her system. Chad Varner was killed last year while he was delivering mail. And take a look at some of the video that KDK shot last year. Police say Tina Phillips was in the car with her mom, driving over 70 miles an hour on Andrews Road in Morris Township last October. October, and that's when Chad Varner, he left his car to deliver a package. And Tina Phillips, uh, her Camry drove off the road and went through a row of hedges before hitting Varner. According to the criminal complaint, Phillips' mom said her daughter became, quote, unresponsive before the crash. And it said that Phillips has a medical condition, epilepsy. And investigators believe she wasn't taking her insulin for that condition and had a spike in her sugar levels. We have discovered uh, was a disparity in the way that she had taken her medication or what she was supposed to be taking daily uh, in order to prevent either, uh, you know, a, a, a diabetic episode. What our officers had discovered through, our, through the investigation uh, was that there was, uh, you know, a spike in her sugar levels, uh, you know, we believe had caused that medical event uh, that caused the accident that took the life of Mr. Varner. And two things to point out, according to the court paperwork, after the crash, police said that Phillips told doctors that she, quote, has a breakthrough seizure about once a year. But about a week later, it says that while in a medical exam, Phillips trying to keep her driver's license denied having a seizure while driving. Reporting live, Jennifer Barrasso, KDK News.